So here is high-tech soilless farming simplified. What does the plant need to survive? They need air, they need water, they need nutrients, they also need the light. And also they need to be standing up straight. They cannot be like floating in the middle of the river. So in other words, if I have a cup of water here and I put the hydroponic, the AB fertilizer inside, then let's say during uh, COVID lockdown, uh, nothing better to do, go under the sun every single day and I hold the plant and I do this. In theory, this will grow. So this is called hydroponics. But let's say I don't want to put the hydroponic AV fertilizer. I put a little fish inside. Oh, the fish swim swim, then they poo, and the poo comes out, the bacteria breaks it down to nutrients, and I do this. This will be called aquaponics. But let's say I don't use the fish. I put other kind of natural fertilizers inside. Then I put the bacteria to break down all this natural fertilizer down, and this will be called bioponics. So in other words, uh, aquaponics is also a form of bioponics, okay? But let's say I don't want to cut. Instead, I put the nutrients in a spray bottle and every now and then I spray, 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 spray. This is called sprayaponics. You know, yeah. This is called aeroponics. Now understand that this is actually a very simplified explanation. Of course, you have to check the EC level for hydroponics. You need to check the nitrates, nitrite, the ammonia level for aquaponics. So in other words, yeah, you need to check the nutrients level for all these things. But in a nutshell, this is basically soilless farming. If you learn something new today, remember to subscribe or follow.